Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here. Hi, I'm Chini and I'm back here today for an unfiltered video after a long time. Mm -hmm. And today I'm just gonna talk about what I feel and my thoughts because it is July 30, literally 12.59 and um, the first week of med is over. Like, made it through the first week of med school. Honestly, right now, hindi pa rin ako makapaniwala na, like, I'm in med na. Parang it feels like I'm not in med school yet, but it's just like, oh, nag aaral pa rin ako. Ganun, that's how it feels. But, at the same time, it's like, you're in med school. Yeah, and... It's just crazy. Parang, in my head, one of those ways I see it is that after this, buhay na yung hahawakan ko. When I finish med school, like, syempre, there's still clerkship and there's still residency. But then, even in clerkship, literally, like, kasama mo na tao, ganun, if that makes sense. And, damn. Yeah. Um, this week has been one hell of a week. Um, had a lot of orientations for all our subjects, and it's not like the type na oh one meeting is orientation lang then pwede ka na umalis kana no, it's what you would expect na after orientation there is a discussion. And we had one meet and greet for biochem, which was nice. But, you know, aside from that, we still also discussed na parang at this point na we're only, uh, how many days? Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Four days into med, I've had my lecture for biochem about lipids. I've had um, my gross lecture about the axial skeleton i've had micro discussion about uh, epithelial tissues and then facial discussion about the cell radiology has already discussed about different imaging techniques um bioethics has started on the different types of ethics and then what else? I didn't have behavioral science yet because that's only once a week on a Monday and last Monday it was the sauna which is why we didn't have classes. So yeah, um, aside from like the orientation and the teachers telling us what to expect, parang it was a new experience also for me because this is the first time na nag first day of class of first day of class ako na hindi siya face to face which is sad but um we're always on cam for FEU. Uh, or on cam as much as you can. Yun. Like, they really encourage you to turn on your cameras and see na you're there. And they have this term that I just learned there, which is Zoom parking. As in, yung papaso ka lang, tapos hindi ka mag on cam. And parang you're just there. And then, ayun. That's why they don't, parang they don't like that. Which is understandable. I mean, you wouldn't really know if the student is there or not. Which is why they encourage to like on cam. And so far, uh, so good question mark. But it's more like I just have to keep myself at my own pace. But also, um, parang make sure that I don't get left behind. Because since things are so fast nga, parang I, I have to keep up also, if that makes sense. Um, and then next week, like, my quiz na kami, my shiftings na kami. Um, by the way, uh, same term, shiftings in terms of medtech and med school in FEU, uh, UST medtech uses the term shifting as like their prelims and manuals, I manuals, prelims and finals, 
but shiftings and FEU is the term for quizzes. So, yeah, I hope you don't get confused if you're watching and you're like UST Med Tech or UST Faculty of Pharmacy. So, yeah, uh, shiftings. We already have two next week. And then um, we also have small, dis small group discussions coming already next week. So, it's really a lot. And... Right now, I'm doing uh, the gross manual because I don't want to cram it before exams since I think this one is due literally the week of exams. So, yeah. Um, did I see my feelings? Um, it's kind of hard to gauge like um, parang how do I explain this? I find it a bit harder to make friends online. Aside, let's say, like, if you know people in your section, in your block, that's so much better. Like, it's so convenient. Um, and luckily, I have naman. Um, so, shout out to Ina and Rish, my blockmates from fourth year internship. And it's nice to have them there. Parang, it's like a piece of home. And aside from that, I have other blockmates and friends naman from USD MedTech who went to F who are in FEU such as Mitch, Shobe, Rose. Um if you've watched my vlogs and I've said their names lots of times you would know them. And it's just nice na parang I know that I still have a support system that has known me ever since. So, yeah, but in terms of making new friends, it's a little bit more challenging just because of the fact that you can't see them, like, physically. But, okay naman. Like, I'm super happy with my block, and I'm so grateful for them already. Like, first few days pa lang, they've already shown how much support, like, they can give. Um, especially the student, student, a uh, student, especially the subject coordinator is, like, damn, ang galing talaga amazing like i'm super amazed and uh, what else i volunteered to be a subject coordinator for one of our subjects which is behavioral science um i don't know much about it yet since we haven't had it like i said a while ago but hopefully it's gonna be good because i i think it's something related to psych um and you know me i'm interested in that so it's all good uh, yeah. I don't think this video will be long, but I really have to do my manuals, so watch me do my manuals for a bit. And just talk to you guys. Wala kang kasama sa bahay. I mean, my mom's here, but then she's asleep na because it is already early morning. 1, 10. And, uh, yeah manuals, a lot of things to write. Oh, um, I don't know. I think I f if I remember correctly, I filmed something, me showing my iPad. But if I don't end up posting it, I'll say it now. So I got an iPad um, for med school specifically. Like I wouldn't have gotten an iPad if I wasn't in med, but we're here. So I got this because of all the things that I have to read, the, the manuals that I have to write, because um, it's gonna save so much time in terms of like I don't have to print and I don't I don't I don't have to scan it and then it's also saving paper, so yeah. Plus it's also a big investment that I promise to take care of and I really will take care of um, until I finish med school. Because, you know, these are like the types of things that you really have to take care of. And there will be a lot of things that will stop the be stored here. So, yeah. Um, if you're wondering, I'll just tell you already, I guess. Um, this is the iPad Air 4 2020 um, in the color Space Gray. And then, um... The pencil that I'm using is an alternative. This is my sister's, but I plan to get one of the same uh, brand. This is the Gujo Doc 
um, pen stylus that this is the 10th edition but there are there also there's also a newer one which is the 12th edition version um you charge it with type c charger it is bluetooth connected you, you turn it on and off by touching the top um this one you can see nagamit nagamit na siya but then it still works perfectly fine um this is and this was in the color white but there's also black pink and another color if i'm not mistaken um it has uh palm rejection and the tilt function as well and it also clips on to the side because it's also a magnet and then uh, if you're wondering i will just share it again i guess um i got my case from green hills in the changge so it's green and yeah it's just a trifold one and then ayun oh this one has the finger fingerprint uh lock thingy forgive me if my brain is not processing anymore this is an unfiltered video and um processing things at this time with my current state of like being tired plus having i'm on my days on my second day if you get what i mean uh, i'm like extra tired but i want to do this because i i feel like if i finish this I'll have more time to do other things, which is important to me, that I get to do other things aside from school. And yeah, parang before it becomes Saturday. I mean, it's already Saturday, but you know, like, it's only gonna be really Saturday when I wake up. So, before it becomes that, I wanna have accomplished something na today. So, yeah. Um, last thoughts, I guess, because it's becoming too my thoughts are like I'm talking about anything na lang <laughs> um, is super proud of myself for getting through the first week of med school and making it out intact because after hearing everything parang sometimes it, it might be discouraging but then at the same time it's kind of exciting so I'm still quite excited for the whole journey and I can't wait to go through it with my block and my friends who I'm with and um, if you also had your first week of med school congratulations to you I'm gonna clap and pat you on the shoulder or the other shoulder and say that you did amazing this week um, congratulations and keep it up don't lose hope have a good support group and um kaya kaya mo yan so many people told me this week susuka pero hindi susuko pero yeah exactly that wag ka susuko <laughs> um just keep going and you'll do great um it's inevitable to fail but you'll learn more when you fail but even with that in mind still do your best <laughs> okay um yeah that's it for today's unfiltered i hope you guys got something out of this or something you know i'd never really know what the point of unfiltered videos are but that's the point i guess so yeah um if you guys like this video please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and um turn on the notification bell so you get notified when i have a new video um this is the first video on my new journey, which is the journey to actual med school, to the road, road to MD. And yeah, I hope you guys continue to support and just enjoy, I guess. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Never forget, there's nothing to it but to do it. See you guys in my next video. Bye!